folks Ola here coming at you from the local lake today I wanted to get out here and try out the Vanford CI4 2500 reel I gotta say I forgive them for the horrible name because this reel is amazing let me let me hold it up to the regular Stratic you can see the difference in the width of the spool just the overall size of the reel. See that, guys? Look at the Strat Stratford. Stratford. There you have it. You got the Stratic over here. You got the Vanford over here. They're both 2500s. See the spools from the top view. They are very, very similar, but the Vanford's a little bit less than half an ounce lighter. That's because of the, the uh, probably the rotor. It has the uh, MGL rotor, super light. The spool is long and lean compared to this short, squatty Stratic. Let me uh, get my line out of the way here. Let me get this when the spool is completely in the high position. Okay, there it is. That's in the most high position compared to the Vanford. See that, guys? This line is short and squatty. The Vanford is long and lean. So this casts much further and smoother than the regular Stratic. Personally, I like the look of the regular Stratic. It's this slotted vent there as opposed to the straight up and down that's on the Vanford, but you know what? It's cosmetic. You can just see. So I'm very, very impressed. There's another good look at them. Very impressed. Let's see if that bale truly is bigger. It looked bigger when I took it out of the box, but I I think it's about the same size. A little bit sh different shape. I think the Vanford has, it is bigger. It's, it's a bigger opening and it has a different bend to it. Yeah, this is definitely a wider bale. This is a taller, narrower bale on the Stratic. So anyway, guys, those are just a few of the physical differences, but as far as castability, hands down, I'll take the Vanford. I'll take it with the crappy name and all. It is a beautiful, beautiful piece of equipment. Don't get me wrong about the Stratic. It's still up there too. It is a workhorse, but you know what, guys? I'm gonna replace all my Stratics, all two make it sound like I have a whole room full. I got two. So I will get one more, if not two more. I might get two more because I do want an inshore reel, guys. I want an inshore reel. And then uh, if I have two 2,500 Vanfords and then a maybe a 3,000, that, that would probably be my a good combo, cover everything. The good thing about the Vanfords, they are salt water ready. They have sealed bearings for salt. I don't know what they do differently than they do in the regular Stratic, but the uh, it seems that the, the Vanford is a combination of the Stratic FL and the Stratic CI4. It's got the best of both worlds and then some new too, some new technology. So. It's a good reel, guys. It is a great reel. And I got nothing bad to say about it. Not yet, anyway. Give me time, I'll break it. But that's about it. I caught maybe six fish out there, nothing big. Oh, I did hook into something really big. And I'm pretty sure it was a bass, too, because it had a head shake. But on the Vanford. And on a, on a bait that I've never caught a fish on. So let's roll this footage 
you get to see the Van Furt in action. Hopefully some of my slow motions worked out and uh, you get to see a couple of fish caught. So let's roll today's Van Furt CI4 2500 fishing footage. Wow, angry hawks. Good morning, folks. It is 7.06 on Sunday morning. I am out here trying to do some upgrades and guess what? I forgot my hog trough. Too late to go back, so I guess if I catch a giant, I'll make a phone call and have someone bring it to me. But otherwise, I'm just going without it. I just really want to try my new reel. That's what it's all about. Let's clear the trees with the rods. Ugh. A little bit of grass paddling. Let's check this out. Oh, set that drag, mama. Yeah, it's this long rod I'm not fond of. 15 pound, pound braid, 30 pound floral leader, FG knot. It's a real, real smooth knot too. I made it super smooth. Took my time on it. She casts like a dream, folks. Casts like a dream. Big old cut tail Yamamoto. I'm gonna throw it right up on the bank up there. Whoa. Yeah, guys, I love everything about it. And the fact that it is salt water proof, yes, these will be my new replacement spinning wheels. Yes, they will. Yeah, that that you hear is my leader not going through through the. Uh, oh, I got a bite. Ooh. Oh, that's a nice fish. That's a fish. I won't make the phone call for my hog trough for this guy. <laughs> First fish on the Banford. It's not a big one, but look at it. Woo. Nice. Whole lot of worm in your mouth, son. And we have first fish of the day. First fish on the Banford. I'll take it. And let me show you something else that's new, guys. See this handle? It floats, okay? Let me see here. You can pop out the arms for stability. Let's see before I drop it. Oh my, look at that. Oh gosh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get you swimming away. Here it goes. Boom! Oh, that should be some good video. So yeah, check this out. Let's do this. Let's let that thing float. It's got the orange legs so you can easily see it. Hmm. I don't know how to tell which way is front. I need to put an arrow on that with some something that won't disappear. So let's see how it looks to get baits underwater. Yeah, I'll paint an arrow on the tip. So that fish went after this big old worm. Oh yeah, that's a cool thing, that little floaty. Let's go back and try to get another. All right. So I'm digging the, you can do it this way too. Just put it together and boom. 
See it? I could just tow it behind me and it would capture everything that's on. Beautifully. Oh, it's calm out here. Just a matter of time. Oh, this is a big fish, you guys. I'm just gonna play it. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, it's a big fish. Well, can't win them all. Oh, it just got hit. Right here at the boat. I saw him do it, too. Saw him do it. I thought he missed it. Number two. Sorry, Bubba. Another little guy. Spinnerbait's good in this grass. Barely hooked. Dang it, it didn't work out. The wind. Spinnerbait has turned on. Another little guy. Number four, though. Spinnerbait has turned on, but... Not for anything worth the size. Wow, you just tore yourself a meaty hole, Bubba. <laughs> just a little turd. But he was right where I thought he should be. Hey, right where I thought. It's like number five, but look how small. 